Stampede is a high-speed monster truck with plenty of power for all-terrain driving, but we're gonna demonstrate how a few simple upgrades can provide a major power boost and dramatically increase top speed. We will install a new power system, change the gearing, and add a high-speed 3S LiPo battery to complete the upgrade. For tools, we will just need 1.5, 2, and 2.5 millimeter hex tools, a Phillips head screwdriver, and a seven millimeter nut driver. See a list of all parts and tools used in the description. For the power system, we will use the Valenian VXL 3S brushless system. This ultra-efficient, low-maintenance system is optimized for maximum power flow. For the gearing, we will install a 25-tooth pinion gear and an 86-tooth spur gear. This gearing will increase the top speed of the model, but should only be used for high-speed running on even terrain. For general driving, you can keep the stock gearing. See the Stampede VXL manual for all gearing combinations. There are many battery options. We will go with a 3-cell, 4,000 mAh LiPo battery, which can be charged with a LiPo charger like the Easy Peak Live. A 3-cell LiPo can provide the most power and speed, but we also like to use a 2-cell, 5,800 LiPo for general driving and long run times. Even when used with a 7-cell, nickel metal hydride battery, the brushless motor will provide more speed and power when used with appropriate gearing. Be sure to follow all instructions and warnings included with batteries and chargers. First, we will install the new power system. With the model powered off and battery removed, unplug the motor from the ESC. Now open the wire clamp and receiver box cover. Unplug the ESC from the channel 2 slot in the receiver. Remove the original ESC from the chassis. Install the new VXL 3S speed control with the included mount and hardware, then route the connector into the receiver box and plug it into the channel 2 slot on the receiver. Note that there are two channel 1 slots, so make sure that the plug goes into the channel 2 slot. Now close the receiver box. See the related video on how to ensure a watertight seal on the receiver box. To remove the original motor, take off the back right wheel and remove the gear cover. Go ahead and remove the original spur gear if installing the new gearing. Remove the original motor. If your model has a fixed gear adapter, you may need to use a different adapter for the new gearing. The correct adapter for the 2586 gearing combination is labeled AB like this one, and the lower motor screw will go in the A position. This adapter is included with part number 3790 and includes a guide for use with other popular gearing combinations. The adapter is recommended for higher speed VXL models and it will make setting the gear mesh a little easier. If installing the motor without a fixed gear adapter, make sure the motor screws are tight and see the related video for more information on setting a proper gear mesh. Put the adapter in place and install the new Valenian motor. Use the included hex screws to secure the motor. Now install the new 86 tooth spur gear and tighten it down. Put the new 25 tooth pinion gear on the motor shaft with the small screw securing it against the flat side of the shaft. With the motor and gear secured, replace the gear cover and wheel. Connect the motor to the ESC using the color-coded wires and plug in the charged LiPo battery. When installing new electronics like a speed control or radio system, it's a good idea to calibrate the new ESC. 
see the related video for instructions. Also, ensure that low voltage detection is enabled when running a LiPo battery. The light will glow green when low voltage detection is enabled. Now the Stampede is ready for even more speed and power. For more tips, tricks, and upgrades, visit us at Traxxas.com.